My name's Michael Alford. I'm a figurative artist, mostly a painter in oil paints, dealing with landscapes, cityscapes, individual figures often painting from life. The consistent feature is my use and, and involvement of figures. Uh, it's a bit perverse. I, I think they're the most difficult thing to paint. If you get the hand on a figure or their facial expression, even the tiniest bit wrong, it, it, the eye goes to it immediately. And maybe I'm making a rod for my own back, but, but that's, that's one of the reasons I like it. The type of painting I admire and, and what I try to achieve is to convey the maximum amount of information with the minimum amount of work or apparent work because often doing that actually involves a huge amount of work but I hate it when you can see that work in the finished product. The, the Victorian Art Museum on the rare painting of pure landscape with no figures of um, the Mediterranean. Uh, more, more of my the monochrome musician paintings, which I, I like. I, I have done these where I've used more color and, and I've always had a problem with the, the kind of brownness of, of the instruments, <laughs> which, which might sound uh, strange, but I, I think this is certainly for the moment a better way of, um, of dealing with it. I find uh, that the way light behaves in the, in the evening and in the early morning much more interesting, particularly in winter, than during the day. To me, it's when cities like London really come alive and uh, acquire a degree of, of mystery and interest that just isn't there in a normal sort of working day. I don't often set off with an idea in mind. I, I recognize it when I see it, and, and then I can come back to it. Uh, and even the simplest little sketch uh, in charcoal or something noted down in a, in a scrapbook, I mean, you'll see around the studio, uh, there are you know, these very, very small sketches which are of a practical size to make colour notes. And, um, and then if they work on a small scale, the composition works, build them up into something bigger. One of the great things about painting as a profession is that there is no limit. It's that constant sense that, that there's something further to aim for. I like. There's also a huge sensual satisfaction in, in the use of, of oil paint particularly. You know, it, it's fluid, it's sticky, it's, it's thick, it can be thin, it, it, does, it does an awful lot of unexpected things and, and th that sort of engagement with, with something that's slightly unpredictable, it's the degree, the degree to which you can control it or let it control you. I, I, um, yeah, when it's going well, it's, it, it's great. Um, and I wouldn't be doing anything else in the world. I mean, I can, I can start in the morning and the day is just not long enough. <laughs>